And this part's weird. I'm, I'm bad at this platforming part, but we'll try again. The jumps are very weird. It's, it's kind of tight timing. Like you wouldn't expect it, but they are very tight timing just to be able to jump up when you need to. All right, let's see if I can get this timing right first try. We did it! Go team! Yahoo! I guess you call it a, a boss fight? Because, you know, it's, it's the claw and you're fighting the claw, but it's kind of like a scripted auto-scroller type thing too, because you have to wait for, for each, you know, coin or whatever. Did y'all ever get into doing the claw machine at the arcade? I I want to say oh, so no one bad. was good at it, but... No, I was terrible at it. I was it. terrible at it. So bad at it. All right, now we also have to watch out for his tail. Ooh, this is going to be close. I may mess this up. Oh my gosh, I saved it. Amazing. It should be fine. We'll be fine. It's fine, team. We're fine. Hot, hot, hot. It's hot. Now I will say I am upset that the game has a bowl of cornflakes when in the movie it's obviously Fruit Loops because he comes up with like the two Fruit Loops on his eyes. So uh, these inconsistencies uh, I know. unacceptable. <laughs> the barrier has been broken. A lot of them in these two levels. more death yo-yos. Once again, if you have more hit points, you can power through these, but we are a little low. YOLO! Hey. Got it. Okay. I sometimes miss that jump, and then I'm like, where am I? Um, <laughs> yeah. There's actually going to be, like, a really important cycle with, with the doors upcoming in this next area, so he's going to fall through here, punch the stormtrooper in the butt, and then um, go through a series of switches. So watch this, watch this. He's going to open this door, open this elevator, now he's on a timer, right? Um, and there we just stole the Death Star plans, so we ended up uh, doing the entire sequence of Rogue One, the $220 million movie in the span <laughs> of uh, 40 seconds. So, well done, Wyatt. Very impressive. <laughs> <laughs> The camera angles. So, like in this game, right. you move. You can move your camera up and down, and um, usually it's with like numpad, like up and down. Uh, but I bound mine to my mouse buttons for convenience. <laughs> mouse droid. Uh, <laughs> yeah, this mouse droid. We're just kind of hanging out in the crawl space. <laughs> He's my friend. <laughs> He's like, look, I'm on GDQ. Look at me, mom. Say hi. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. But here on this level, uh, YS is just going to be grabbing the yellow key taking these elevators and doing one of the large, larger sequence breaks in the run. Coming over here, looking down, setting up a TD jump, is going to jump over and nice. land on this narrow catwalk. First try, getting the key, ending the level, and moving on immediately to one of the most difficult levels now in the entire run, Jabba's ship. We are doing a time capsule, which is my show here. Uh, we do it every other Tuesday, but uh, we've got all kinds of different shows, all kinds of different speed games. Uh, if you want to know more about that, you can just go to Gandalf. Games on Quick Slash Topics. <laughs> <laughs> we all heard was Gandalf, and I'm like, wait, can you explain this a bit yeah, first? Exactly. And so here, in the name of freedom and justice, uh, we're coming through and, and placing a bunch of mines through the level, and then we are going to be facing off against a number of dark troopers. And Bias's ammo looks really good coming through here, but here's a really tight TD jump. Oh, the mouse droid! <laughs> he didn't like the he didn't like the words we uh, said earlier. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> While on research station, yeah. <laughs> they're like they're all like communicating. They've got like all like a network, mastroid network. Oh no, they inter they they're like ahead of the the dial-up internet. My goodness, <laughs> what is this? Oh boy. So did you want to show off the ice yes, physics? Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, feel free to. It's so bad. So yeah. So, like, <laughs> Like I was trying to explain earlier, I'm moving completely around. I don't have the booties, the ice booties. Um, I just run into a wall. Here, let's try this one here. I don't know if that one will work. Yeah, and like, I'm like, I'm pressing all my keys. I'm just not moving. So the way to like, get yourself unstuck is to actually boost yourself with some momentum. So I can just throw a grenade and I'm back. So yeah. you, you might've seen that when I was doing this section over here. 
um, with that setup. And that's pretty much why I did it, because I wedged myself in the corner, and then like I boost myself with a couple of momentum, and it pushes me that way.